While climate change related events like drought, heat waves, wildfires have battered France, one group has emerged as a reluctant winner, the salt farmers in the northwest region of Gironde. Our next report getting you the complete story. Salt farmers in the northwest of France are emerging as a group of unlikely beneficiaries as the country suffers from blistering heat waves and drought. The record-breaking high temperatures and almost non-existent rain has led to increased salt water evaporation. We are heading towards record production. At the moment, we are looking at over 2.5 tons for each pan, while the average for the last 10 years has been 1.3 tons. Gironde Snow White Fleur de Sel, or Flower of Salt, crystallizes on the water's surface. It is one of the finest salts in the world markets. Dubbed as white gold of the salt trade, Fleur de Sel retails in the United States at more than $100 a kilogram. In a region better known for its variable Atlantic weather, with rains and cloudy weather all year round, more than 40 days of uninterrupted sunshine and light winds has meant that salt workers are overworked. Under the baking sun, workers wheel barrows along the narrow mud walls that separate each pan. They scrape the sea salt from the bottom of the flats using methods and tools that have changed little in more than four centuries. No machinery is allowed in the harvesting process. There are some producers who have already stopped working this season. Some have stopped picking up sea salt and others are stopping flour of salt because they've fulfilled their quotas. And others still have simply drowned their sea flats because it's a tough job. They start at 5 in the morning and most of them finish at 10 p.m. Salt producers worry that the intensive pace made necessary by this summer's endless sun is unsustainable. We are setting records here and we are wondering whether the salt pans are capable of producing as much or not. Are we going to have to be more careful about how we produce the salt? There's a lot of water management involved to produce the best salt. Salt pans are fragile mud structures in which the seawater evaporates. These pans might not survive such rigorous work year after year. Farmers are saying that they now have reserves that will last for the next couple of years. Bureau Report, We On, World is One. We On, now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.